That's my point. <laughs> Go nuts, who cares? And so, here we are today, to do that review. Hey guys, welcome back. So, today's video is going to be another review, and I finally have a name for it. So my review series from now on is going to be called Nailed It or Failed It. Meaning the product that I am reviewing, if it's good, nailed it. If it sucks, they failed it. So there we go. So the product for today that I am reviewing is the Egg Mousse Pack Facial Mask by Too Cool For School. So I hauled this in my birthday haul about two weeks ago now. I can link that down below if you want to watch. And I said I was going to review it because it was such an interesting product for me. And so here we are today doing that review. So I'm just going to give you a really quick background on this product. Like I said, it is a mask and it's a mousse-like mask enriched with egg extract. Makes rough, dull skin smooth and radiant in five minutes. So the egg white extract moisturizes, which creates clear and luminous skin. The egg yolk extract maximizes skin's moisture level and leaves skin silky smooth. And then just the mask in general, it's supposed to enhance the absorption and efficiency of skincare products. So got a few claims going on. So now I'm just gonna open the box and show you what the actual product looks like. So it's kind of in a shaving cream like bottle. Got your little nozzle right there. So pretty much you put this on your face. You can wait either five minutes or 10 minutes, anything between there. And then you just rinse it off and then you're good to go for the day. So now that I told you what the benefits and the claims of this product are, I am going to show you right now on how I applied it what my skin looked like before and after using it so here we go hey guys welcome to my bare face and a very messy bun I just wanted to show you guys how I apply the egg mousse pack uh, mask and so here we go and so as you're gonna see right now it's like a mousse like mask or kind of like shaving cream almost it doesn't smell like egg that much. I thought it was going to be a kind of a gross smell, but it's not too bad. So I just kind of loosely apply this all over my face. If I get it in my hair or in my eyebrows, I'm not really going to care just because it dries uh, clear. And like after you wash it off your face, it doesn't affect your eyebrows or anything like that. So go nuts. Who cares? And sometimes as you're applying it, if you do one side first and then work on the other, by the time you're done the other side, this side will be all clear. I've noticed that sometimes when I've applied it, but today it's all looking pretty white. Okay, so that's pretty much it. Got my under eyes, there we go. Okay, so you can leave this on your face for five or 10 minutes. I always leave it on for 10 minutes just because I have the time usually, so why not? I will come back in 10 minutes. <laughs> All right, so the 10 minute is up and I'm just gonna rinse this off because I don't have a sink or water near me to do so. So I'll be right back yet again. <laughs> okay, so this is the final result of me rinsing it off. My skin just feels a little bit dry and that's because I have like dry skin. So any product I use on my face, I have to moisturize right after or else I get this little drying effect on my skin. But other than that, my skin does feel like very, very soft. And I will go into more detail once I have a face on and my hair is done. So in case the video clips were a little unclear on how my skin looked before and after, I did take pictures of my skin, like I said, before and after um, when I used it like a week ago or so. So here are the pictures of that. I guess you're just what I needed. What I needed. And from those pictures, I can tell personally that the after photo does look more uh, like radiant. Nothing too drastic, but just a nice little radiance to the skin. Nice little dewiness going on. So my overall thoughts on this mask is that it does a pretty nice job. So yeah, I would use this mask um, 
before I was getting ready for the day, just like I said, to add some dewiness to my skin. So right after I use this mask every time, my skin does feel a little bit tight and dry. And that's just because, like I said, I have dry skin, so I feel like that just plays a little part in that. But as soon as I moisturize or use a serum or whatever, my skin feels like back to normal. It feels super soft, super silky, and I really love the way this mask makes my skin feel after I moisturize. But even before I don't moisturize and stuff, my skin still feels really soft and silky. It just feels a little bit tight and dry as well. But I feel it's more of a tightness feeling than dryness. It still feels really soft and smooth. That's my point. <laughs> I just noticed too with using that mask and then doing my makeup throughout the day, my skin still looks uh, pretty radiant and dewy. And when I don't use this mask and I put on my makeup and stuff, there's no dewiness going on. So my final verdict on whether or not the Egg Mousse Pack mask is a nail it or fail it. I'm gonna say they nailed it. It's a really awesome mask. In Canada, this costs uh, $25. The price will vary depending on where you are from. But for $25 for a mask, that isn't too bad of a price just because you really don't need that much to apply. And for how often you would use it, I wouldn't use it every day. I don't think it would hurt your skin if you did. I personally just wouldn't just because I don't want to waste the product up so quickly. So I've been using this product about two times a week, maybe three times if I'm going out somewhere special or something like that. But I find using it twice a week really does help my skin look silky and smooth and radiant and I am just very happy with this mask. So if you're on the lookout for a mask that helps with some dewiness and radiance to your skin while helping it look silky and smooth, I would highly recommend checking out this mask. And also too, I like how it's a shaving cream mousse texture. And so that just adds in the fun of using a mask. I don't know. It's a nice little feature, okay? So all right, so that is my review for this egg mask. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please uh, comment, like, subscribe, share, do whatever you feel like doing. And just until next time, I will see you all later. Bye.